Two days before Thanksgiving, the KW restaurant in Winston-Salem, North Carolina, was packed with senior citizens. All invited for a free lunch, courtesy of Josh Howard. This year was really special for us because it's a lockout and people expect that when it's a lockout that Josh is gonna forget about the community. And this was our time to prove to the community that we're really serious about serving our community. So this year was really, really special because it, you know, we had to dig deep to really give. We served 300 uh, senior citizens this year, and it's an amazing way to start the Christmas holiday. The 300 invitees, an exponential increase from last year's 200. The need doesn't change, the holidays doesn't change the need, uh, the economy makes the need even larger. People who have been retired are probably now looking to be rehired uh, because you know the way the economy is. And for those persons, especially people on a fixed income, this means a great deal to come out and get an extra meal like this free, you know. For Josh, it was the least he could do for the generation of those who helped to raise him. Senior citizens are the people who, like you said, paved the way for, for me and you, you know, everybody in America, you know, especially African American race, you know. So um, be able to, to do the things that I've done, you know, for the senior citizens, you know, and like I said, to receive the response, you know, it goes a long way, you know, because I learned a lot of my morals and values from my grandma and mother, you know, it was a lot of old school, you know, learning, you know, and it, it, it helped me out to this point, you know, so, you know, if I can pass that on to the, the younger generation, it's a great stepping stone for them to get going. Every year, Josh thinks of something to do, and this is a wonderful thing at this time of the year to do for the seniors. We appreciate it so much. So many people will be traveling and so many people forget about us or use us to cook. We're in the kitchen for hours at a time. But now we only have to come and sit and just enjoy his servitude and I think it's a wonderful thing. An old adage, it takes a village and I believe that this is the village that Josh sees, the community that he's still supporting now. These seniors weren't just here for the thanks, they also found it in their hearts to give once again. On behalf of the seniors from uh, East Winston, the 14th Street, Golden Crown, yes. uh, Sprague, yes. Haynes Holdry, yes. and the dance group and the crafters, uh, we want to thank you. We collect our dollars to give to your foundation. Oh, thank you okay, so thank much. You. I appreciate that. We appreciate that. everything thank that you, you do. Thank, <laughs> thank you. you so much. Thank you. stuff out there, you know, like you said, with the economy and all that, you know, so um, find a solution, you know, to help people out the best way we can through my foundation is what I've been doing and, and we're going to continue to do, you know, from senior citizens all the way down to the young kids, you know, so I'm just blessed to be able to do it.